That puts your power level over 9,000. Now, of course, the execute comes Spike through. Planted. Space Station have managed to successfully make their way onto the A side. And they actually have a lot of players down below in hell. Sick going to find the first one onto Bustio. Inski and company down below on the hell side. Profi going to be playing towards the arches, waiting for any potential players to come into the free room. So far, Shazam finds one. They drop down. The engagement happens. Sinatra's going to help the Frenzy spraying through, and it's trade for trade for trade. It's down to Profi. Sinatra with the frenzy to be, but Sick and Dapper have pushed up a little bit to maybe meet SSG a lot sooner than they may be expecting. They're really holding on and anchoring this spot. Cage triggered. The one way for Dapper, he'll back away, find a new angle, but now it's actually space station running away they might decide to split up the middle there is a trip fire there shazam's gonna cut them off great shot from him on the up now the leader to try to give them safe passage and a cage as well but zoms did a great spot door closed that's unfortunate for space station they're just stopped at every push and that's ultimately what sentinels need to do to stall for time there's 15 or so seconds left on the clock and dapper is just going to be a nuisance here get into a good position to stop this plan from coming in he's got the camera up left. and now they're starting to funnel through he needs to hold the line here spray is going to come he's the one but that will fall now the plant is coming in as the rest sentinels funneling in that's one player that's Seth backstab onto zoms down to the 2v2 sinatra oh that was so crispy out to profi down to roca and if I'm going to be honest, if there's anyone I want in this 1v2 scenario, it's Roka. They know that he's Not going to be in Boathouse, though, because of the recon dot. Shot from Shazam, trying to bait him out. Fortunate shot did connect. Tag down Shazam, but around in the pocket for Sentinels. It was a tough ask for Space Station as they were trying to figure out where to get that spike down in Sentinels. Stop one man. Thoms now is going to have to deal with the push in. Has the Bulldog. Shot's going to be good. Onto Bustio, but he doesn't get traded. Dapper now here participating as well, but can't convert onto anything. An interesting updraft. You don't really get to see that angle too often. Almost connects in. Oh boy. Roka's just going to scoop that one up. Down to the 3v3. Aftershock down below. One does get injured, but Roka's going to be the gatekeeper there of them dropping down from the heaven side. That's one down. Has a little bit more to work with. Trying to escape through the arches, but he'll get shot right in the back. They know they're down there. Trying to spray through. One will come easy here for Seb, but now it's just down to Sinatra. And unfortunate for him, a lot towards this B side. And as a result, Zoms is here to support Dapper, but this is an eco round. Pretty interesting ultimate to use. Well, they're using so many ultimates when it comes to this. Profi bringing out the Hunter's Fury doesn't get too much, even the, from the shadows. Ten seconds left. They're using everything. Why are they Five using planted. so much to Last confirm this standard. round? Do they not realize that Sentinels haven't really bought up all that much? It's flawless for them, but they used what? Neural Fet? They used pretty much all of the ultimates that they had. The only one that they didn't Getting use ahead. is to run it back. Oh. Tend to not You're see so very many. You're dead. Sova op players, but Profi trying to take it into his hands. Find some value. Bustio, the running back, does find sick and will teleport back after finding some value in the fruit market. But Dapper's there. He's laying and waiting for them. Good tags as well. Waiting for the utmost important moment to use the cam. But Bustio and Niski will find the picks they need. Down to the 2v2. Spike down, so it's in a little bit of a tougher spot. Shazam's waiting for Zoms to arrive at the fruit market. But Bustio's playing down by logs. Upgrade now for Shazam. The Phantom. There's the player down behind the logs. And as he's dropping with the spray, beautifully done down to Inski. Zoms with the paranoia. Here comes the smoke. He's trying to play close. Shazam does get taken out, but Zoms comes in from 30 seconds least left. Expecting the rotation to come on over to B. That's unfortunate. Seth will take that, but I mean, Sentinels are a little bit more aware what is happening so sinatra has to hold the angle but that's fortunate for profi he gets in at the right time there's the peak in the window but it's a little bit claustrophobic here seth's gonna find shazam a little nervous a little bit afraid zoms is gonna crack under the pressure as well it's all down to sick all off the play from seth pushing up the middle and the timing of the rotation for sick back over towards the b site 
put Space Station in a huge position here to win the round. Fault line was potentially being used, but Seth, a great Michelle, is, is going to be used to see exactly what's happening on A. The rotation not quite being bought at this point, and Shazam gets that first kill again. Bunch of for Profi, but they've already managed to make their way onto the site. They still have to deal with the players playing close. This is, of course, a little bit of an awkward round. Dapper and Sick! They hold him off! Dapper with another! Down to one final player, Zinski. And they just... Oh, no. Rush him with the threat again. Zom's playing a bit more aggressive. You know that there's something going on on A. He's in fact going to try and peek him and does get one before Inski trades him out. He's going to keep them at bay a little bit. Shazam has been so good with the operators so far. Can maybe add another one as Roker is on his right hand side. Imagine he's got a lay. He is going to use it. Sinatra's going to at least try and help out Shazam and support. But Inski catches out Sinatra. Whoa! That's having another great game. Definitely sees one, but can't necessarily oh. land their shots. Zoms straight forward, clean up for him. Hedgehog comes in from Profi with a frenzy, but yet again, the bigger gun wins. Zoms is just surviving everything this round. He's just keeping the, <laughs> the dream alive here. Inski does find Dapper. Still injured members on the Sentinel side. Two of them, as they push on in, they'll actually stay towards the B main side. Shazam holding down mid. Sinatra's already inched closer to the site. Unfortunate for Inski, that's tough. Shots were standing. in the general direction that needed to be landed, but Shazam posted up here in the middle. Doesn't really need to do much, but let the rest of his team just do do the dirty work. You might be able to pick this one up. Yep, that's pretty easy. Now this is the gun round, up and coming. This is the Oh, that is such an un to lose early. Profi will at least find a redemption frag, but guess who's there on the opposite side? It's Ski. It's gonna find two super important frags, but it's down to the 2v2 around. Desperately needed to be won by SSG. Put it down to the 2v2. Spike gonna be planted here by Shazam. Still up to full. An interesting camera to have a good angle into B main. So they know at least it's coming from spawn. It's coming from market. Shazam. Alongside Dapper holding down the site. Dapper going to be looking into the bottom side of the boathouse as Roka and Seth working together. Here comes the swing. Here comes the Leer. They're starting to push through. They know Dapper's up above. And a re-peak, but Shazam's on the opposite side. Dapper wins that one. Now it's just down to Roka. And good on Dapper to swing after Shazam fall. It's a lot of that information is now being sold that, hey, no one's here. No one's in the courtyard. No one is anywhere. This is going to be an A side hit. They see player towards the generator side. Now they start to push in, but it's unfortunate for Shazam. He gets a face full of lead. Profi on the opposite side with the Hunter Shuri finding a frag for himself and tagging Sinatra in the process. This is not looking good, especially with Bustio wrapping around. Space Station are starting to pick up steam. Roker on an aggressive angle is still wanting to just take fights. Knows roughly where Dapper's going to be. I don't think he expects Sinatra to be on the other side of this doorway. Roker down to 55 HP requires a bit more support out of Inski, who's going to be just spraying in the smoke as Sinatra does One take down the Raider player now. with the shock dart. Within the smoke, Seth, make sure that Sinatra can't get too much else. Uh, Dapper, again, with... the way the flank towards they made, so they know to expect it. Dockdart's coming through. Likely towards the hell side. Now it's just down to the rest of SSG to push back in. Inski, Bustio, Profi. That's going to be good for Profi. Find Sick. That's another one on Sinatra. Things are not looking so good. They know where the players were coming from. They had to move that. Now it's just down to time. Dapper's going to fall. It's all down to Zombs. And it's not enough. What a beautiful retake for SSG, despite Sen even knowing where they were from, where they were coming from. Well done find another round on the board. I was very worried. Strange angle as well, but he does get sprayed off. 88 HP is what he'll survive with. He's waiting for that cage to subside. Six is going to find that pick. Now it's Seth trying to hold the line from the tree room, and he smoked off the Zom. But there's the flash. Rio, Six is going to take him both. Give it to him. Oh my goodness. Gets to the fight in the smoke. Inski will take him down, but the damage is deadly. Sam now on the retreat. Profi will find Ooh. Sinatra trying to enter into the B site, and that's actually where the spike's located. Down to two members, and they're split on both sides. Ah! Brophy! The headshot onto Dapper Zoms. 
will take out Inski, but both playing remaining. like a man unleashed. That's three on the round. Paranoia. Subs will fall yeah, to the clutch for Bro. Looking directly down the barrel. The flash is going to push him off that angle. He is fully flashed. But the hunt is fury from distance from Profi. It's good enough to confirm one kill. It tags onto another with Jet, but it's only going to be the one so far with the ultimate. It does get traded, but you like the value you get out of the Hunter's Fury. Information and frags to boot. Sinatra gotten a lot of ground on this A site, but now it's really just up to how SG left. want to retake the site. Dapper's in a unique position as the timing of it just works out so oh. perfectly for him. Sinatra finds one, does get traded. It's up to Dapper now. The slow move back over towards the site. Up the ramp he goes. Go. This is the play that we need to watch. There's the clone. He can either wait this out. There it is. Fires Easy out. frag for him. Now pushes through the smoke. They still have no idea. Now Seth's kind of wondering what is going on. Is this down to the 2v2? Dapper's down. Cypher v Cypher action. It's all down to Shazam. The spray's good, but the tracers, they get spotted. Inski will take him down with the headshot and SSG. Onto and Roka wants to play aggro in A main, but the Eldron is going to temper him. Flash is good. Bustio flashed out, but Inski gets Shazam in the process. In fact, he gets two. It's all falling apart yet again. Sentinels were looking to be going to overtime, and it's exactly that. He's going to try to reposition. Does eventually have to take up they're gonna swing on him from both sides he's got a great angle roka will fall now tail winning to safety doesn't survive though the angle from the lower side of the catwalk and that's i think was planned out by ssg knowing the op was gonna come in having an angle just in case things did get a little scarier and that's roka down he's now we're back to the 4v4 they knew that shazam was gonna go for that aggro peak and it was good of ssg to know that they could trade him good play from Minsky to chase up and make sure that the jet can't get away now pressure onto zombs holding from underneath hell hopping up to just see if he can spot anything but stops just left. as this execute starts to come in recon dart is a miss from profi actually but the paranoia is going to catch on to some sinatra now with his own recon dart is not going to use it in fact opts to just try and push it One normally and remaining. zombs through the smoke clears up nicely great round from sentinels there is going to be early spot out onto Dapper. Shadows but other than that, it's really going to be the mid play here. Oh, yes, they're on the opposite side. Yep. Doesn't even need Inski. Profi's just leveling up huge. Shots are going to be good across the board, and we're likely going to get another overtime. Profi is low. That person natural. What could he do in this One two versus five? Remains. Would be a hell of a clutch, but just as I say that. Inski. Uh, the performers here for SSG. The fall line comes through. Seth, Seth's still in the same position as he was before, and that spike is going to end up on the A side. Like, that's really what the entire plan was all along. Roka's in a really tough spot, does get paranoid. Beautifully done by Zombs. Two players down for SSG. The Profi and Inski remain. Those has been shutting their face as they tried to go through tree. There's no time, no time for subtlety either. They've just got to barrel it through. Planted. Four players from Sentinels over on the site. Smoke is a good one to allow Sick to transition away. Help out from A main alongside Shazam. A tall order now from SSG to try and bring this back for this retake. Flash in. Another flash through from Bustio. The wall goes up and Dapper's on the right side of it. And not just going to spray through Bustio. Dapper with another. And now, of course, to teleport through. It's a flawless round for Sentinels. It's up to Dapper behind the dice. Cage goes up. Doms is there as well. Good shot there for Shazam. Now here comes Dapper out the cage. Shot after shot after One shot is connecting. Remaining. Trade after trade. But it goes ultimately to the faithful last time. This time... Might have a little bit more. Shots can be good for Shazam. Shock darts once again find Seth, and he's down to 9 HP. Become bolt does spot him out. Yep, just shots through the dice. Now Profi's trying to wrap around onto Zalms on the catwalk. We'll find that frag. The rest of the players still have to worry about Inski, who's throwing utility out the window. Shots going to break through. Bustio will now work with Inski to go through the tree room, while Profi will get tripped up by the tripwire down the A main. Shazam's going to be holding the angle. So we get an aerial view of the site. Sam playing in wine cellar. Profi's not going to expect this. Doesn't have a lot of utility shots. One gonna be good. Remaining. That's unfortunate. Down to one final player. It's Inski. 1v4. 
Sentinels are just trying to push this map over the edge. Shot's going to be good on to one, but Dapper Attackers will win. seal the fate. Spike down on the B site. Trophy playing flank, but he does get tanked by the camera. And now the spike continues to tick. They're just trying to clear out the B site to start Shazam playing in the smoke. It's a very cheeky spot. Profi actually finds a little bit of success now as they start to try to push through. The burst classic works out for Shazam. He finds one as well. Sinatra down to the 3 4 Profi is out of the picture. And now it's just down to Inski. Shazam is really just paired up. Here comes the push with the six. Run it back. Hunter Sphere to try to stop them from moving forward. It doesn't actually tag anybody there. The tags will come through. Now the push comes in. Shazam will get traded as Profi will actually find six. Going back to his clone. Down to the 4v3. Spike still not planted as that's Zom's duty. Now as the owl drone starts to come through, they need player, players to come in from the connector side. But Zom's finds a huge pick and they're actually not playing towards that long side. They're playing close. That's a stinger, unfortunate there. Now the swing comes in just down to Roka in a 1v2. He's playing close to the logs. They're just trying to wrap around. Zom's gonna fall first. He's overhealing, does not decide to dismiss to gather that information. Dapper with the 3k on the round. Sent him. Sick in an aggressive spot. Really now it's the case of Sentinels expecting flanks, but no, not really. SSG all going to be piling from the same general direction. You even have Seth just checking for the flanks just in case Sentinels are trying to wrap around and catch people out. Not quite going that way. An arrow theft is good to use if I Sentinels jam. could get that kill, but Bustio gets a second with the ultimate. Hopped in, gets a third, wow. but can't quite connect onto Sinatra. Just looking in behind him. Now the number game, very much in favor of us. Oh, that's Last huge for Sinatra. Finds three. It was looking so good for SSG, but now I don't think he's got enough time. Profi is going to die to the spike. Yes, it was an ex but a bit more utility for an out of SSG. Trying to guess exactly where Sentinels are going to be attacking with the recon bolt. Shazam wanted to find a duel. We'll find two over on his B site. He's gonna break in. The spike is over there. Oh no, never mind. It's right at his feet. He wasn't holding onto it, but Brophy is now gonna have this spot. And awkward duels now as both sides are trading out. Spike planted Seth playing towards the doors. He's likely gonna peek on through. For some reason, I thought that they planted the spike for B, but Sinatra's got a lot of ground. Ooh, Bustio in a lot of trouble. The shock dart doesn't help. Sick will clean him up. 12 seconds remaining, but that doesn't matter now. Here comes the Empress for Roka, but it just goes away. It's a little bit unfortunate. Down to the 3v3. Sick using the running back to get some space. Seth is going to extinguish that flame, but now it's Roka jumping down. But Sinatra wasn't down below. That's the 360 for Roka. Sick will enter back as it's now all fallen down to Dapper. Hat comes through. They know where he is, but he knows where they are. I know what you know that I know, and I know that Seth will find the shots necessary to take down Dapper. Put a round on the board. Four rounds remain. They need three out of the four have a similar stature of what happened in that last round and with Shazam doing things like that it's just no, well don't. unfortunate even with the the, the Zerg rush from SSG it, it takes three or four players to take down Shazam on the Seco Paranoia is gonna put Seth in a tough spot and now it's just down to Trophy who's hoping for a shot shock dart frag somewhere Ultron is going to I feel like Jobby gets a lot of information on where people are playing from and sick with the running back is let's be the opening onto the site. The peak comes through, but Shazam is able to at least get that first kill. Shazam now playing off the site is hopefully going to jump and see if he can get any more. Now Dapper playing from short is going to back off. The spike is left in a weird direction, I suppose, from Sentinel, but it's not going to matter too much. The spike is not going to be the objective that's played around with Roka only having a sheriff. Sick gets a second. And we, I'm surprised that they weren't expecting that kind of play. Bustio and Seth, though, have managed to get some stuff in, but Dapper with the shot has made his way into the center of the map. They are now going to pincer the only member left, which is Seth, who went all the way through to A-Link. He's good for one before Shazam trades him out. Coach influencing how the set strategies might play. That's not a bad thing. It's just Sentinel are the pride and true definition of I do what I want to do.
And Zom's, Zom's is doing that. <laughs> yeah, he's it's exactly what he's doing. Um, Shazam finds the pick. Likely another one in the back here. Sanat down towards alongside. Owl Jones going to spot him out here. There he is. Shot's going to connect. He's still waiting for a player to cross, but Bustio wants to try his hand. Shot's going to be good. Yep, he inched a little bit too slow. They'll pick that off back up. And wow, through the leer, tries to take that shot. Doesn't quite connect. Broca will take him down. That's an off exactly picked up, but already look at Dapper and Sick. It's unfortunate that the Neural Theft has spotted him out. Profi trying to use that up. Tries to come back, but they're already gone. Dapper is playing a little bit on the opposite angle there. They're going to back away now. A good attempt, but they're pinched in. Can't really go towards the C site now. And as a result, you're seeing Sen wrap back around to the A site. I'm the shadows available. Zombs, he's on this angle, left. he gets a kill and onto the spike, so it's a free versus free, but he doesn't expect Brophy to be there from A long. One Six able to get a few more. And now a one versus one. Sinatra wins win. it, he puts it to bed. SS.